Hi, I'm Sara and welcome to Ten Corner. Today we're making tzatziki, a traditional Greek dip, which we absolutely love as a family. When we're on holiday, we have it for lunch every day. When we're at home, we have it with salads and barbecues. And um, when we've got family and friends over, it works just as well with hot food as it does with cold food. It's a yogurt dip, yogurt and cucumber dip. So the ingredients are Greek yogurt. Now Greek yogurt is natural yogurt that's been strained through a cloth. And um, by straining it, excess liquid comes out the bottom and then you've got the thicker yogurt that's left in the top so we're using greek yogurt we're then going to stir in some grated cucumber now i've got mini cucumbers from my veg box this week so we're going to put in a couple of mini cucumbers but big cucumbers are absolutely fine as well garlic is quite an important part of it so we take the papery edges off the garlic um, and then I've got some mixed herbs, put a bit, pinch of mixed herbs in, a bit of salt and pepper, mix it together. And this is one that is worth leaving to stand for about an hour before you're going to eat it, which means you're ahead of the game and you can enjoy some drinks on that before dinner. Um, you don't have to rush around getting everything ready at once. But um, the reason we like to make it in advance is the garlic that we're going to grate into it has got time um, for the flavours to, to meld through um, the whole dish and meld through um, the yoghurt. So you've got that lovely even flavour rather than um, plain yoghurt and then sharp garlic. So what we're going to do, we're going to start off with the garlic. I've already taken the outer cases off and I'm going to grate it because I've got the grater out anyway for the cucumber. So I'm going to use the fine grate setting here and I'm going to grate the garlic and this is a nice quick way of getting small bits of garlic without having to um, do anything fancy or risk chopping your fingers or getting a garlic crusher out because you're using the grater anyway. Grating it down, don't grate your fingers in. And then what you're left with, scoop it out with a knife, We've actually got very, very fine, finely minced um, garlic, and I'm going to put that into my bowl that I'm going to mix it in. Then the cucumber, I'm going to go for slightly coarser grating this time. Grate the cucumber. Now, if it's a big cucumber and it's very watery cucumber, you can um, take the grated cucumber and give it a squeeze through a clean cloth or a tea towel or, or, or through a sieve to try and remove some of the excess water. I mean, the water's got a nice cucumbery flavor to it, but the water will make your dip more runny than maybe you would want. But these little cucumbers, they're not particularly watery inside, so they're just gonna go in whole. Not whole, grated, but not strained. So I'm then going to scoop out, whoa, Make sure you get everything off the grater because you don't want to end up just washing away valuable food down the sink when you were doing your washing up. So I've got my cucumber there. Whoa, that's going to go into my bowl. And then the yogurt goes on top. Now, I'm not giving you quantities here. Work with what you've got. If you've only got half a cucumber, put half a cucumber in it. If you've only got half a pot of yogurt, use half a pot of yogurt. If you want to make lots, put extra ingredients in. And the garlic is to taste, so it depends how, how garlicky you want it. We like it garlicky in our family. Then into my bowl, I've got, already I've got the garlic and the cucumber and the yogurt. I'm gonna put, some salt. I'm going to put some mixed herbs. I'm going to put some black pepper. And I'm simply going to mix it together. Now, on holiday, when we have this, when we're on holiday in Greece, it's simply served with a drizzle of olive oil on top and with a hunk of bread on the side to dip in, which is a beautiful way of eating it. Pita breads is how you would have it served if you had it in a, a restaurant here. Um, it's lovely just as a salad on the side. Um, 
appreciate white on white you can't really see sorry about that um it's lovely with cooked meat i've got some roast lamb in the oven so we're going to have it with that um it works well for an easy lunch um and again you can make a big batch of it um take it out of the fridge serve up what you want put your container back in the fridge and you'll probably keep well for three or four days in the fridge so make a nice big batch um, and enjoy it on the side of every meal and it's one side dish sorted and one less thing to cook every day so i hope you've enjoyed that that's nice easy greek tzatziki um, and it's one of our favorite dips and i hope you're going to give it a go yourself and i look forward to seeing you soon bye